Hey guys, and welcome back into Anno 1800. We are here with our little fleet that I have assembled. We have a fleet of four battleships and two monitors. And this fleet is about to go lay some smackdown on some pirates, because I've about had enough of them attacking my oil tankers. So, first thing is first in this episode, we are going to war. Oh yeah, you better turn around. Let's go ahead and crank that up into high high gear here. He's sailing against the wind, so he is basically dead. Moving to coordinates. How thrilling! A renowned person. Uh, that's a renowned person. Let's grab him real quick. Just an ensign, not serious. Attention for the admiral. All right, let's get up here and do this. We're we're going to go and go to war with the pirates. Waking new horizons. He is booking it back home, isn't he? Now, I've got several decent um, guns and different stuff on here, so it should help me to take out some of these cannons over here. Prepare to fire. I'm going to put them on all out attack so they don't stop. Some of us need time to regroup. Stations. All right. Or now. now that's just unfriendly. Let's do it. Way. I haven't wanted to do this for so long. We are going to war. Oh, look at it. Boom. Oh, God, he just got wrecked. Get freaking wrecked, sir. Keep an eye on those monitors right there. Oh crap! He's got a Beforian. Yeah, now you're gonna have to wait. Oh god, he got a freaking Beforian pirate. Oh come on, no, stop. There, get him. Ship under attack. Unfortunately, I don't have any active healing on any of these, I don't think, no. Oh, shit. Come on, get out of there. Stop it. What are y'all doing? Get out of there. You're going to get blown up. Oh, jeez, what an idiot. Yep, there he went. Okay, that's fine. The battleships will carry the day. Ship was destroyed. You lost some influence. Please engage. Let's keep trying to take these things out. You got to take out Betty. That's the one that's really hurting me right now, is Betty. Oh, jeez. Big Betty hurts. He's almost down. There's that one. Okay, good. Okay, we might be able to hold out now. Try to get rid of the, some of these others here. What's left? What's still attacking me? Oh, it's that cannon up there. Oh, there it goes. Wonderful. Let's quickly take out these last couple of cannons here. We might lose the other monitor. I'm not super concerned about that, though. Okay, I think I just took him out completely. I did. Pirates have been defeated a good deal. Now, a ship is destroyed. 
Okay, I lost both of the uh, monitors, but that is okay. We'll go pick up some of the items from down there. Uh, do you have room? You've got room. I believe it's a 30 minute timer until they show back up. Okay, and we are going to leave a couple of these guys that are a little... Yeah, we're going to leave a couple of them down here. We'll send the other two back home. Back over here, at least, to uh, heal up. Let's drop off this stuff, and we'll go sell those two items. Now, once you destroy the pirates, I believe it is a 30-minute timer for them to show back up again. And they'll come in with a small fleet, and then you have to kind of take out the fleet and everything else. So I've never experienced that before. I've never taken out the pirates. So we will see what happens. Basically just kind of effectively blockade this. Commencing war patrol. Uh, no, not trade route. Ah, stop that. Clear stations. Patrol route. That'll be enough. Patrol the pirates right there and just kind of watch uh, after them, mostly. All right, let's sell whatever's in here. Get rid of that. Bring him back down. We have an extra cargo ship right there. Let's actually just go ahead and send you back to Cape Trelawney for the moment. There we go. The pirates were dealt with. I see some people, they build like these huge fleets of like 10 battleships. I'm like, nah. I'm good with just like, what, four battleships and two monitors? Which, sure, I lost the monitors, but they're just monitors. They're not really that crucial. What was crucial were all those. Where are they at? There they are. These guys. Guns blazing. That's I'm right. Confident you have ready to go. I completely forgot that I had items in here that needed to be used. Whatever. Alright, siege successful. Assault on the island ensures island is taken by force. Good deal. Town is fireproof in tomorrow's world. Let's publish that. Alright, they're going to go back and start healing up those two battleships right there. Now, let's get back to Cape Trelawney and see... I feel a What's going on here? Okay, unveil rewards and yeah, more t columns and mosaics and stuff like that. Yeah, it's fine. All right, our next goal for right now is I want to get. Where do I want to expand that at the moment. I think I want to expand up here. Which I'm going to move uh, our zoo around for the moment. Actually, I'm not going to expand. I'm going to get some more investors in. I am in desperate need of investors. This is a good spot for a bunch of investors right there, but I need more oil coming up there which we've got plenty of oil there i've been running into a problem where i'm not getting any oil brought in from anything um not oh no 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 say that again i'm having a problem with oil not being delivered correctly for some reason so i'm very hesitant to do it but i'm going to just because I, I need i need to upgrade some more guys so we're gonna go right there with it And we're going to go this way with it. Okay, good deal. Okay, so we'll wait for him to get some uh, oil delivered. Hopefully soon. And while we do that, it probably also means I need to go back to the new world here. Uh, maybe not. No, I think this right here is actually going to be enough. 
I have enough oil coming in from all these places, so yeah, I don't need to uh, don't need to build any more oil for the moment. I'll have enough. Let's uh, crank that on up and watch and wait for some more investors to move in or electricity to come in, so I can upgrade some of these engineers into investors. Uh, we could go ahead and upgrade some of these guys. Yeah. Bunch more engineers, which in turn will be turned into a whole bunch of investors here pretty soon. I'm going to go ahead and destroy all of this, because this is going to be a canal as soon as I can get the canal pieces. Hmm, you know what? Actually, I just thought of something. Your ship has returned Let's redesign that a whole, just a little bit. There we go. Redesign this just a touch here. Okay, let's slow you down. You're going like 10,000 miles an hour. Uh, let's put a flag in the middle of this one. There we go. Oh no, how unspeakably... Oh hush. Come on, get some oil. Well, while we're doing that, I want to uh, build another zoo somewhere else because I'm going to split my zoos up a little bit. So I think I'm going to do an aquarium. Hmm, I want to do the aquarium at. Game save. Where would be a good spot for that? Could do it like something like down here. I can move a bunch of this right here around. Ah, no, because now so I've got a good town hall right there. No, it's not a good spot for it. Never mind. Actually, here. This is where it's going to go. Let's move that there. Let's move the hospital over to here for right now. And let's get a new zoo going. We'll start it right there. It's not going to stay there. I'm going to have to move all these. These are the World Fair tiles thing. that I've gotten right here. And if you destroy them, you lose them. So I tend not to uh, destroy them. Move them by hand. Okay. We are going to work on, let's put a goblin shark in. This is all from the abyssal depths stuff, so. Let's go maybe something like that. Oh, and the zoo is one of those that's just completely not even and drives me completely insane. Helmet jellyfish. And prickly sea devil. Oh, wait, you're already facing the right way. Good deal. Um, let's see, what else? All right, the blobfish. All right, blobfish. There you are. Now let's go. Maybe one extra over. Is that it? No. Maybe one more? So it's not so, uh, crowded. Hmm. How do I want to lay this out? It's very unnerving because it's none of it's the same. Like, you can't center any of this up. 
And that completely drives me up the wall. Let's try this. Ooh, the only problem with the aquarium stuff is it can get rather uh, boring looking because it is all the same stuff over and over again. Yeah, maybe if we toss in something that's not a shipwreck over and over and over and over, maybe that'll be a bit better. My brand. Okay, I think I got something going here now. Let's see, we also need a orca. Okay, so that has a little bit different look to it, so it uh, kind of breaks up the monotony. The Out of influence, I can't build anymore. <laughs> never mind, never mind. All right, well, let's just get some uh, plazas going on up in there. At least do that. And that'll be a good for the moment. Okay, now let's get some influence because that is what we are lacking. I'm just going to randomly upgrade. No rhyme or reason to it, really. Just clicking buildings to upgrade. Okay, there's some more influence. Where'd that aquarium go? Okay, what am I missing? Well, we're missing one from the Abyssal Depths still. That's fine. Okay, we've got both of those. Uh, I think the Coral Reef. Hold on a second. Let me check the Coral Reef one here. Isn't that... Yeah, see, I like that on occasion. That right there really breaks up the... Uh, that monotony of the same building over and over again. you add in some of these guys. Alright, let's see. I already got one of those. A balloon fish. And I'm just gonna plop a few of these in sperm whale. That's in a that's in a different one. Now sperm whale doesn't actually like count for anything. It just looks cool. Bottle no dolphins a baji. Oh, that's one of the legendary ones too. Here it is. That's it. Hey, Baji. Oh, whoop, whoop, whoop. Well, okay. Let's do this then. Instead of that, and instead of that, let's put Baji front and center, and we'll put. The bottlenose dolphin back there. There we go. That'll do. And do we have anything else that I could put in down here? Well, I did have the storefish. I had to take him away. 
and firefly squid. So let's put in that uh, sword fishing in. Good deal. Let's actually uh, move him there, move him there. Nope, not there, right there. Just to kind of break up so it's not the same stuff sitting next to each other. So there we go. Nice little aquarium started. We got a. Uh, we have one more we're going to put in so there. So one, two. Yeah, we'll put a few, a couple more in there. And then we'll, that'll be it for the zoo. We won't put any more. I'm actually going to go ahead and just uh, block this off to where I want it. And that came over from two and that came over two. Although that's not going to work quite right, so we'll move it to three, and it's just going to be off by one tile, and I'll have to just deal, I'll just have to live with that, because that's fine. That'll give us a nice zoo right here. a little bit and just give a little space around it. Now why are you being... oh, that's why. There we go. Okay, that's what I was looking for. Now we've got some billboards we could put in, just maybe as a uh, like little info boards, maybe. There, and little tiles. Okay, cool. Liking it. I'm liking it. Now, do I want to put in these columns? Or do I want to put in a fence around it? I think I'm, I'm thinking a fence would look a little more appropriate. Yeah. There. And we'll work on a fence to go around it. And something like that. Cool. Good deal. The start of the aquarium center right there. The aqua center. I'll probably redesign it a little bit to give some space between some of the buildings. That way I can put in, like, parks and stuff like that. Oh, we've got another renowned personage. Captain Ibrahim, good deal. Thank you, sir. Now that means up here we're going to have this guy right here. And I don't know what I'm going to do with him just yet. I really don't I only still only have enough to finish off that one. I'm still missing one for the rainforest. I haven't really done a whole lot of animal stuff this run, so still missing quite a few little critters that we need to go and look for. So that's going to be a thing I have to go and do. Yeah, and I'm already kind of not liking how clustered this looks, so it's going to need to be uh, spread out a little bit. Something else some more of these type buildings uh, birds and stuff like that are good to get because they will give you these buildings right here that you can use to break up all of these tanks next to each other so that's going to be something I have to look into uh, let's get some more houses going though oh good I was worried that that was not going to be even but it was. So we're good there. We're not going to be good there, though. Although that that uh, school is going to be moving. I'm not sure where I want to go over here with it all just yet. Let's see what, what what can fit right there. 
that can fit there, actually. You can go here. You can go there. You will come up here. And you'll go there. Okay. And then stone bridge right there. We got all these bridges right next to each other. Lovely. Ah, uh, I can't do a double bridge across that. That stinks. Come on now. Well, let's try and get this even real quick. Good. Okay, that's what I was afraid of. We're gonna do this. You will uh, see my master plan you here in a second. You milestone. I don't know who keeps reaching the village status. It's kind of kind of funny. So we're gonna do something like that with this design. Okay, and we'll uh, we'll take out the school once we don't. Oh no, we're gonna need it. So let's put the school down there. Go there. There. Actually, I don't need this one. Take that out. Put that in. Good deal. Uh, how is the university coverage up there? Pretty poor, actually. We're going to need another university up here, I believe. Or do we? Universities only needed to upgrade uh, these guys. So we. No, we are going to need it. Cause otherwise, they will complain. So we'll go ahead and put a university up there just to uh, get them covered. Okay, let's see. This one right here, I'm going to leave a space like so. I'm going to try do... You know what? It's just four of these. I don't care. I've got a plenty. There, we're gonna go here. We're gonna take that middle row right there out. We're gonna go right, right somewhere. I'm not sure where. Actually, there's where we're gonna go. Yeah, we're gonna go right there with him. Should still have good coverage, yeah. I think we're still good on the coverage. The people celebrate your leadership. Okay, if we do that... It's because I tossed in that uh, one extra row right there. I removed him... Oh gosh, what kind of what kind of perfect symmetry have I gotten here? Oh, this is like this is like perfect symmetry. Check that out. I didn't even mean to do that, but I did that. Okay, hold on. We're gonna have to, gonna have to work with this now somehow. So usually means I'm gonna have to do that. Come on, come on, move. There you go. Move, and we'll do this, and we'll do this. Now, the reason I left this... Oh, well, let's fill this in real quick first. Uh, yeah, some of these. The festival has ended. Now, the reason I left that blank is because I want to do something the like has grown uglier. this. We're going to go there, and then we're going to go under, I believe it's engineers? No, it's under artisans. Artisans, we're going to get the piazza benches. And we're just going to 
place some of these Using down the nurse, center. I knew they'd get well soon. All right, good deal. Uh, no newspaper stands down through there. Uh, ugly it up. We will, however, create a neat little arch pattern right there as a little entryway into this place. And we're going to just place down a whole bunch of blasts. So, once it get all, gets all engineered, actually, I don't much care for like that. Let's instead do something like uh, maybe just that and that and then do a tile down the middle. Yeah, that's better. That's better. So once all that grows up to investors and stuff, it'll look like a uh, Maybe not with that. Maybe we'll do... Uh, where's my favorite little poplar? Because it kind of looks like a planter around it. Yeah, there we go. Some little trees. Sweet. And they've got all... So now we just got to speed things on up. But anyways, yeah, once it's done, that'll kind of look like a, uh, they called them arcades, is what they were referred to as. Kind of like a little arcade, just a long strip between buildings that was kind of, it's usually actually covered in glass, uh, but it looked kind of neat. What I might do is once we get, once we unlock some more World Fair items, I may redo that and add something in there to even make it look even more like one of those arcades. And it, it'll look pretty cool. Uh, let's go over here and add Game in. Save. It'll be like a park in the middle. There we go. Good deal. And are these guys ready to upgrade yet? Just about. What are we at? We're at 7,800 investors. I, I actually right think that means it is time system. for, yes, the large exhibition. What's our strategy? Fabric, felt, chocolate and plantains, rum and beer, goulash and canned food. I wonder what this means. Oh, goods reduction, okay. Interesting. I've never seen this before. I guess I haven't paid attention to the investment. Goods reduction 29%. 29% of the goods amount will be deducted from all visitor demands. Huh. Well, let's uh, get that going. So this is going to take felt. Oh, hold on. let's check him. Okay, he's all good. Uh, felt, a whole lot of beer, a whole lot of goulash, Uncompromising journalism. and chocolate. Now, we the do have some ended. felt, but we do need more. So let's go to the New World real quick. Let's uh, load up our ship here with hungry. some... F uh, let's just load it up with a whole bunch of felt. And take that to Cape Trelawney. We have enough, I believe, but we, we're going to need more. So, yeah, I've got 95 in stock right now. So I've got enough. I should have enough of everything else. Goulash. Ooh, do I have goulash? Yeah, I've got some. Probably need to consider doing another goulash. Plenty of beer. Yeah, we're good on everything else. So we will right let that happen, and we'll see what we get. I'll probably get that off screen, and I'll tell you what we get in the next episode, guys, because we are so out of time right now. I hope you have enjoyed. Thank you for joining me. If you did, go ahead and drop a like down below. Subscribe if you want to see more content from me, and we'll see you in the next episode. Until then, take care.